I was working on that uh, window yesterday, and when I tried to put the outlet back in, the thing sparked on me, and I was wondering what was going on, because there shouldn't have been no live power there. And this is what I got here, and it had a metal box in there, so, and those GFI outlets, they're very, very fat, so something must have been hitting up against the side of it. And uh, so what I'm doing is I'm putting in a, putting in a plastic box. You know, I don't know whose bright ideal it is to use metal boxes on a metal building. I don't think it's a very good deal because <laughs> if anything goes wrong inside the box, it'll electrify the whole building. Um, back when I was back when I was in the army, I lived in a trailer, and uh, there was some kind of a short, and uh, we had a little dog, and uh, every time he touched on the ground to get in the house, he'd get a shock. Walk in with your shoes, nothing happened, but uh, because he'd get a good ground when he would stop up in there, he'd get a little shock. So over the time period, he learned to jump. <laughs> Ever since that time, I've been a little bit leery about the metal buildings and things like that. So I'm going to put this, uh, this plastic box in here. We'll see how it goes. what it looks like and I just used the cut-in box and now I know it's not going to be shortened out against the metal I don't know I don't know who did that
this wall all done, I was trying to cover up this pipe here, so we had to make this wall a little bit, a little bit uh, thicker. Um, but it worked out. I didn't want to have a hump in the wall. Mainly, I didn't want those bolts hanging out of the bottom. It would be a hazard. And so this wall made sick. But the rest got the rest of the windows in. And tomorrow, I'm going to do the electrical and insulate and probably build the loft. So, overall, it was a good day. Um, as you can see, we got quite a bit done. Uh, got this wall done and all that. And, uh, but uh, running up and down that ladder, it gets to you after a while when you're my age. And uh, so, you know, that's what you do, you pace yourself. You know, back in my younger years, I'd get up at four in the morning and, and work until one, two o'clock in the morning. And can't do that anymore. The old bod won't hand, just doesn't handle that anymore. But, you know, I can just work at my own pace and uh, eventually it, it'll get done. That's one thing about watching the video, it gets done real fast. <laughs> oh, I wish it was really getting done that fast, but, you know, it takes a long time. But anyways, that's it for today. We'll be back tomorrow.